first back in early 90s, and I went through the whole routine, you know, of, of taking various drugs, and I tried some other uh, approaches, and I ended up, by the time I, Dr. Wander's ad popped up on my Facebook page, um, my, uh, I was taking 150 units a day, 50 at each meal, of um, Novolog, which is short-acting insulin, uh, and my average blood sugar reading, I would say, was around between 220 and 240, taking that much Novolog. And I'm also taking, I was also taking Lannis for long-acting insulin. So I went to see Dr. Warner maybe about 10 weeks ago or so. When I walked in the door, my A1C was 9.5. Mm -hmm. uh, it's It was 7.5 six weeks later. Um, and uh, I haven't taken any Novolog insulin, none, not a single drop, for I'd say about a month. My, I ha I've had several runs of days where my blood sugar didn't get over 90. It was about 130 this morning when I got up. Um, and it's, you know, and all I'm doing is just a very simple, uh, whatever he suggested, which I'm going to let him discuss it, because as they say, it's different for everybody. So it was different for me. It's going to be different for you. And I'm just going along with what he said, and that's all I do. And everybody is amazed. My doctor's amazed. I'm amazed. Uh, I feel better. I've lost a little bit of weight. Um, and so... You know, I say uh, go for it because uh, I, had, I think I don't know if my body could have absorbed any more insulin. I don't know if my, my fat cells and my my gut could have could have transmitted any more insulin into my bloodstream. At the I was injecting like a like a porcupine. Wow. And uh, so, at any rate, that's my testimony. Thank you for coming.